Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, The Game Moving Game. I've tried to record this video a couple times and it has not worked. And then the last time it's working fine and my mom interrupted me. So, in your dock, you should see System Preferences. We're going to turn our game up on Mac for your games. You're going to get the displays. Make sure your brightness is all the way up. If I bring it all the way down, the screen goes to black. I bring it halfway, it's dark. All the way, make sure it's all the way. You can go scaled, and if you click on those, it makes it bigger. I'm not going to do that. Then, if you do automatically adjust brightness, and I unplug my computer, as you can see, the bar went down. I was not touching it. My mouse is over here. If I plug my computer back into the charger, it's going to go up. And that just saves battery. So, you want to go to um, color. You're going to hit calibrate. Continue. Uh, you can do either of these. I prefer to want to. I suggest you do that too. Pick a color you like. I think I'm going to go with that one. Uh, name it, whatever you want. I'm going to go with that. Okay. Did I mess that up? Oh, alright. Well, when you do it, hit export mode. And hit continue. And you want to line that up just right, but I'm not going to. I'm going to turn it all the way up if you want. I'm going to put mine about there. Hit continue. I'm just going to do that on all of these. Go to the top of the paper. And this is going to make my screen brighter. The more I do this, the brighter my screen gets. Also, it gets, like, looks foggier. Now you can do it 1.0, which is super bright and hurts my eyes. Around 1.8, it's not too bright. 2.2, it's not too bright. That's really neutral. I suggest, if it really matters that much to you, go 1.8. Then you're going to choose one of these you like. Keep mine right there. Wait. I'll do D50. Then hit continue. Uh, continue. Yeah, continue. Done. So now your screen looks a little weirder. That's alright. I'm gonna open Steam here. Check out the available updates. That's nice. Probably should have go, gone ahead and opened it. Do it now. I'm gonna get the one with that. Now I know a lot of you don't know how to do it on the Mac. That is why I'm making this tutorial. Cause like nobody knows how to do it on the Mac, and it's annoying. All right, can we like get a move on? Let's hit cancel and see if it'll pop up. Time don't pop up. Don't pop up. Don't pop up. They do not pop up. You responding? Oh, it says you're not, but I can feel her, so. Alright. Oh, there you go. I'll make you feel alright. Next, so I like to play Rust. I'm gonna play Rust. I like to play Rust. We don't really care. Don't really don't really don't really don't really don't really don't really If you hit, if you hit F3, but you don't actually hit F3, F3. If you do, if you do F and F3, that means F3. But if you do the key that is shared with F3 on a Mac. <laughs> Complicated. It opens this up, and you'll probably have two windows. Let's see, Let's see. Here. Why is it? Why is it like this? I will fix it later. So I'm just gonna go to my favorite server real quick. I can make you feel alright. Might take it a minute to load. There used to be a bug. 
when on the Mac you had to keep your um, graphics really low so you could just run it. Now my graphics aren't that low. I can run it. Alright. As you can see, everything may not be to you, but it is super bright. I'm not sure if the camera's going to catch this, but I hope it does. Anyway, it is super bright, and when it turns night, I'll be able to see. Not like it's day, but I'll be able to make out every formation. It'll be like it's day, as in the fact I can see everything, but it won't be like this bright. Oh, gotta go get that airdrop. So I really hope you guys like this video. Give it this video, subscribe, all that good stuff. See you later.